This is Ralph from Rapid Holding Systems with another video for you for your uh, CNC machines. This is our flexible vice system. How it works is there's these pins. They're all spring loaded. And what they do is they will actually take the shape of your part. So if I push these in, tighten that up, it keeps the shape which is awesome. That way, if you have angles, irregular shapes, so super easy way to hold them. Instead of having um, hard jaws on your vise or having aluminum jaws that you're machining all the time to match whatever part you're trying to hold, these things avoid all of that. They will literally hold whatever part you need, take whatever shape, and they'll hold it super solid. So, And they're super, super simple to use too. So after, let's say you take your part out, you load your next part in, release the handle, the pins go back to normal. Put your next part in, tighten it up, and now you're holding the shape of your next part, which may not be the same as your last part. So super, super simple to use and um, really, really flexible. So we have a few different configurations of these. So I'll start with this one. This particular one, basically the headstock moves. So let's say you had a small round part like this that you wanted to nest in here. Obviously it's round, very difficult to hold. So what I would do is you can't advance this enough to hold this smaller part. So what I would do is I would take the tailstock, loosen the screws, and move it. In my part, move my tailstock to probably here should be good. Then I would put my screws back in. Grab my part, nest my part. And you can see the pins are starting to take the shape of the part. Then I would lock in. So these basically lock the pins into shape. When I tighten this, it compresses the pins and locks into that shape. Now the pins are locked to the shape, then I take the handle, give it one more little tighten. Now the part is solid, you'll never move that. So this kind of is a super solid way to hold any shapes, round, curved, castings, any particular shape you need, it'll hold it. With this particular one, like I say, when the tailstock moves, you can also, um, this is very universal. So another way to use this vise is you can, the bottom plate, you can unmount your tailstock and your headstock, and you can mount them into whatever plate you want or on your CNC table. Now we have our part firmly secured in there. So now let's say I had 10 of these to machine. So it's simple. I can leave my pins locked in place. I undo the vise, pop my part out. Now the pins keep the shape of my part. Now let's say I had my next part to machine. It was a little bit different from this, but basically the same shape. So I just load it. There, tighten up the vise and now it's solid and now I can machine my next part. So if you had a number of castings or a number of irregular shaped parts where you wanted to keep the pins the same, you could do that just by not unlocking the pins. If you wanted to unlock the pins, it's super simple as well. So I just unloosen the handle and now they're back to the way they were. Another way this vise can be used is I could take this plate, remove it, use the headstock and the tailstock just on my CNC table, or I can make my own custom plate as in this configuration here. So a customer wanted to do exactly that. He wanted the headstock and the tailstock, but he wanted to machine different parts of different sizes. So he just ordered the headstock and the tailstock without the base plate. So now he can mount them as far apart as you want or as close as you want. Same type of configuration where the pins fit to any shape. You lock the pins in like that. This side here, you would lock the pins in. Now you tighten this, this part moves and you clamp your part. So it's uh, similar to the other one, just without the base plate. You can also use them separately or you can combine them on top of each other like this as well, where you have maybe taller parts that you want to nest. So now you can buy multiple blocks of this individual one. And then the same thing with this side, you can stack them up, they're modular. So now whatever shape you had, even if it's taller, wider, you can mount these wherever on your table and still support your parts. So just super great design, excellent idea. And for a machine shop, for holding irregular parts, you won't find anything better on the market. Now the third configuration is somewhat similar, but it's a more compact design for uh, basically the jaws go about six inches wide. So if your part's six inches, and this is a self-centering version. So some people like the self-centering version as both jaws move at the same time. You can see both jaws moving, same precision ground vise, same headstock and tailstock, but now they both collapse in on your part. Self-centering version, it's all contained into one. Or if you want to keep your same center of your machine for some reason, and the, the headstock and the tailstock act like a more of a normal, I guess, vice. So I would take my part and the same type of idea. There, so once I have it, the part snug, I tighten up these handles. Now it holds the part in there, and then I give the vise one more little tighten. Now the part's super secured. And it's the self-centering version of the same vise with the same handles that lock the pins in. Again, if you had your next part to do and it was a similar shape, you would move them apart and it keeps the same shape. So same thing, just a more compact design. So that's basically our three options for our flexible vise series. Anything you need in the machine, any size parts, castings, a regular shape, we got you covered. Super simple to use and you'll never make another vise fixture again. If you like the video or want us to shoot more videos, Ask any questions, like and subscribe below. Thank you.